Hey guys, DJI have just released the latest firmware update for the DJI Mini 2. Now, although this is only a 49 megabit update, it is a huge update, especially if you have a smart controller. So let's just have a look at the release notes to see what's new. So with this update, this adds support for the DJI smart controller. It also optimizes FPV mode. Now I find FPV mode on the Mini 2 to be just quite average. So if it's gonna be any better than this, then this is gonna be fantastic. And I look forward to testing that properly coming very soon. If it's anything like the Air 2S FPV mode, then this could be excellent. But it also enables and fixes the issue which people were having where they are using the official DJI charging hub and then the batteries were auto discharging and then your batteries were either flat or just not working properly. So it also fixes that. And then finally, it also says it improves the flight stability and reduces the quantity of compass calibration prompts. So overall that sounds a really good update so how are we going to update this so make sure you've got your actual drone connected to the rc and then connected to your actual phone and then you can start to download this and it should only take about five minutes to download it so let's just cover some of the points now so if you don't have a smart controller this is dji smart controller it is pricey at 579 pounds which quite ironically is more than the actual DJI Mini 2. Now, this has been around for quite a while now, but the smart controller allows you to fly without actually using a mobile phone. And it's normally reserved for the bigger drones. So being able to have this compatibility on the DJI Mini 2 is certainly a fantastic step forward. Even on the DJI Air 2S, it is compatible, but there's a lot of lag. So it's great to see that this is now compatible with the DJI Mini 2. So if you've got a smart controller, then fantastic. This is gonna be a fantastic addition and you'll be able to now use this with your DJI Mini 2 straight away. Just make sure you've updated your smart controller to the latest firmware and your DJI Mini 2. That said though, the smart controller has been around now for quite some time and when this came out this was revolutionary and it was brilliant that really good display but if you've got one of the latest phones such as the latest Samsung's or iPhone Pro Max Pro display phones then these are actually really similar and I've tested the smart controller and also with my current phone and because the peak brightness isn't much different it is a lot of money to be spending on that controller if you don't have it if you do have it fantastic this is going to be a great addition for you and it was widely reported of people putting their dji batteries into the charging hub which isn't a third party charging hub it's the actual official dji hub and that was causing loads of problems with the batteries discharging so you've got it charged in there you turn up you go to fly and they're flat so this is a big problem it was a widely discussed topic this so it's great to see as well that this has now been resolved so if you've got a charging hub you're good to go again make sure you update to the latest firmware update and that's been solved so fantastic to see that two of those updates out of the four are going to help so many people and it's great to see this this is a fantastic firmware update in relation to the fpv mode and the stability flying of this drone i want to test this out fully and i'm going to be doing it straight after this so i will then let you know in a future video just how well that is now performing and is there any difference with that fpv mode i didn't want to rush out and put this video out without fully testing that FPV mode and just giving you basically a one minute review of that. I wanna actually do a proper video and explain what differences are, is it any good, is it any better, or is it just a bit of a gimmick? But, so that's gonna be coming really soon. But as I said, this is a great update and it's fantastic to see this. Certainly, if you already have the DJI Smart Controller, you're going to love this update. So go and update this, connect your drone to your phone and then to the remote controller and then update this. And it only takes a couple of minutes. So go and have fun with this and I'll get some updates relating to the flying performance and the FPV mode really soon. So quick update there, guys. I was planning on releasing the How to Make Money video, which is part two, which I've been spending quite a long time on. But because of these updates, that's just going to be delayed by a few days. So I am really sorry about that. So in relation to the free well ND filter giveaway 
So let make sure you comment on that video. Don't comment on this one. I've unfortunately due to this update, I'm going to have to just put that back a couple of days. But the video where it's two ways to make money, as soon as that's going to be released, hopefully on a Saturday or Sunday, I'll let you know. I'll post a picture on the YouTube channel, just letting you know. And comment on that, guys, and then I'll pick somebody at random. And the, as I said on the picture, you you can actually have any of the free well all day pack so if you haven't got an air to s that's fine you can actually get one for the mini 2 or the mini whatever you want um, just let me know and then i'll pick somebody at random so on that video where it's going to be two ways to make money just got to like subscribe to the channel to freeways channel and then just say to me in the comments why you actually want these filters and i'll just pick somebody out all right guys thanks so much Bye bye